Welcome back. Today I'm doing a clothing haul for Roan. Now, I gotta say right off the bat, I did not think that Roan was going to be a company that was exactly for me. I don't know why, when I've looked at their clothes before, or maybe their marketing before, I was like, this is more for my dad. It's not really for people my age, because I'm so young, right? And I have to say that I was proven wrong immediately. I absolutely love this brand and I definitely did not expect that. So I'm really excited to take you along with all the clothes that we have today. It's a big clothing haul so stay tuned for some of my favorites and for some of the pieces that I'm not so crazy about. Let's do this. Ooh, on the homepage they've got some swimwear. I should have checked that out. Okay starting with our first piece of clothing and that is the five inch Mako tech short. So I got these shorts in Castaway in a size small and I'm really, really pleased with them. I think of them very similarly to a 10,000 short. It feels the same style. It also feels the same quality. So it being $68, I'm pretty sure that's the exact same cost as the 10,000 short. And honestly, I like the company a little bit more. So I would much prefer this short over a lot of the 10,000 shorts. I got these online because I don't love uh, to have my compression shorts and a liner in shorts. Uh, and I think that they're also just a really smart design of having the two pockets but only having one zipper pocket. Just really smart, I really liked these. Going into the Swift Tank, I also got this in Castaway. And I think it's a fun look to do, you know, the same color on the top, the same color on the bottom. This is a super standard tank. One thing that I really like about Roan is that their logo is that triple X, right? It just looks like a stitching. And y'all know how much I hate logos. I love this logo. I love how unassuming it is. I love how you can have it on every piece of clothing, but it isn't stand out. It's not super in your face. It just looks nice. So that stitching right on the shoulder there, I'm a really big fan of. I also love that it just has that nice little pop of color on the shoulder as well. Here's the thing. I would say out of all the clothes that I tried on for Roan, the tank top is probably the thing I'm most disappointed in. You can tell by feeling it that the quality of this material specifically is not the best. It's very similar to the material that they use in the Nike tank tops. And I just get really worried about it pilling because that material is just, it doesn't hold up very well with wear and tear, especially at the gym. So sometimes I'm nervous that even if I'm gonna like rub my hand on it, that it's gonna start to pill. And I hate that. I hate when my tank tops do that. So if I had one big complaint about Roan, it would be that I wish that their tank tops were made out of a little bit of a more expensive or better material. But I really liked the cut, I really liked the look of it, uh, and matching it with the shorts, really cool. Moving on to the four inch Swift short. Now, I love a five inch short. I love a four inch short even more. So I really loved these. I love the chili pepper. I think they're super vibrant and fun. I will say that the liner of these, because I did get these lined, was a little long when I wear them on a run. I don't love that the liner is showing quite so much on my thigh, but that's just a personal preference. What I do love is that these shorts have a phone pocket in the liner. So I literally went for a run with these shorts yesterday and I was able to put my phone in there and it felt super secure, like it wasn't gonna fall out. And especially with the running short, that's really complicated because a lot of times the pockets are not big enough to hold your phone or it's super floppy, right? So I think that's a super smart design. A lot of companies are starting to do this now and I'm glad that Roan picked that up as well. These ones are a little bit more expensive and I think that's probably because of the liner. It's right bordering on the line of too expensive for a short, but $78, I'm still like, you know, it's a good quality. I like the material. It's gonna hold up pretty well, so I'm kind of okay with it here. For this Swift Tank, I also got it in Chili Pepper, and I also got a size medium, just to see kind of where the discrepancy is in the sizing. So I got a size small for that first Swift Tank. This is a size medium, and it definitely is a little too big. I could wear this, especially if I were to tuck it in, uh, but the sizing kind of made sense to me. I'm generally a size small, and if I were to size up, especially if I wanted more length, it does generally get a little too wide for me. So uh, just something to keep in mind of how their sizing works. I think it's pretty consistent from brand to brand, actually. I'm generally a size small. A medium was gonna be a little too big for me. Moving on to the resort jogger, and I have to tell you, I love these pants. I think that they are such a phenomenal, like deep navy color. 
I think they are so beautiful. I love the material of them. You can tell that they are really well made. And you know, I love a jogger. I'm always looking for my next jogger. So I'm a big fan of these resort joggers. The other thing about all of their pants at Roan is that you can dress them up or down. You know, I would feel 100% comfortable wearing these pants to the gym because they are such a stretchy material, but they also have those belt loops along the top, which I'm kind of 50-50 about, but it does make it so that if you wanted to dress up these joggers and make it so that it was like office, attire, you could. You could put a belt on and make these look a little bit dressier. And honestly, like, that's exactly where I am. I know that a lot of companies are kind of there where they're like, we want you to be comfortable. We don't want you to have to wear a suit anymore, but we do want you to look nice. And when we look at these resort joggers, I think they do look really nice. So just something to keep in mind, especially when I paired it with the rain short sleeve, if you tuck it in, there's no reason why you couldn't wear that to the office, especially if you work in an industry that is a little bit more casual. The rain short sleeve, how do I describe this? I, there's nothing else to say, but it is made out of some of the most lovely material I've ever felt. Outdoor Voices had a shirt that also was very similar to this material where it just feels super silky smooth. And I know that this is a $68 t-shirt. I absolutely am aware of this. It sucks. <laughs> I, you know, it's, a, it's such a bummer when our athletic clothes get into that range. That being said, it's a really good shirt. It's a really, it looks really nice. It feels so nice. You can tell that it's going to hold up. And if you're going to have this shirt for multiple purposes, if you're going to work out in it and you're going to take it to the office with you, or maybe not to the office, but you know, if you're going to wear it out to dinner, to not a fancy place, I don't know, uh, to a mid-level place, $68 is fine and it's going to stay looking nice. So I really liked the matte green. I thought it was a nice, subtle color. I was pretty obsessed with this shirt. Ooh. Okay, really quick, if you've been enjoying this video, don't forget to click the link in the description of this video and use code PRIDE15 to get 15% off your order of Roan clothing. Okay, let's keep on going with the clothing haul. The commuter pant and the commuter jogger are some of the staples of Roan. I am just getting that vibe because they're kind of the pants that are most advertised on their site. And the commuter jogger specifically I really, really liked. Here's the thing, I got a size 28 because that is what my waist is. When I wear my pants up, like where they're actually supposed to be, I am a size 28 waist. And I think I probably should have done a 30. It's tough because they really fit my waist perfectly and so that I don't need a belt or anything like that. But along the legs, it was pretty tight. And I like that, but you might be someone who likes your pants just a little bit roomier. And so maybe going up one size for these would be a good call. I'd also say I really want to look at the other colors in the commuter jogger because the khaki could definitely be used to dress up. But I don't know if I'd wear the commuter jogger at the gym. It's the right material. It's stretchy. It has those zippers on the back that allow you to like roll it up if you needed to. But it's not necessarily a gym material. I'd say the resort jogger is a little bit more gym oriented than the commuter jogger. So I'm just curious if the reason I feel that way is because of the khaki or if it's because of the actual material of the jogger. Okay, so here we have that Swift tank again, but in a Eden color. And I actually really, really loved the vibrance of this green. You know, I am colorblind, but <laughs> This color uh, is something that I've been wearing a lot more lately and I really like it. So it's the same material as the other tank tops that we've talked about already. It's the same tank top, it's just a different color. So once again, I'm just worried about the pilling of the shirt and the quality not being quite there. The rain long sleeve is the same material as the rain short sleeve, go figure. Uh, so it's so lovely to have on you. The one thing I'm always worried about with a long sleeve shirt is how it fits in the armpits and how do the arms feel. And this shirt, I don't know what they did, but they really, really sized it correctly. A size small, didn't feel like it was crowding the armpits too much. The length of the arms was really great. I also love this fountain blue color. I think it looks so, so, so nice. You could wear this on a run, or you could wear this uh, to dress up your commuter joggers, which I really loved. So I think that this is absolutely a no-brainer, especially for $78. Again, it's not cheap, but for a long sleeve that you can dress up and dress down, it's very functional. It has a lot of purposes, so the price tag 
makes a little bit more sense to me than some other brands. Moving on to the commuter pants slim, and it looks like these are on sale right now, very on sale, which is great. Here's what I'll say, I don't love a straight pant, you know that about me, but these pants are really, really good. They're the same material as the commuter jogger, and what I will say is that very similar to what Lululemon does with their alterations, Roan will allow you to hem the pants as well. So. I believe that what you can do is when you're ordering them, you can ask for the hem or they will give you $10 to take it to your local tailor to get them hemmed. You just send them a receipt and then they will reimburse you $10, which is pretty cool. I love it when companies do this, um, just to make sure that the pants fit for you perfectly because these, as you can tell, they're a little long on me unless I roll them a little bit. So I would probably get these pants hemmed. Once again, we've got another rain short sleeve shirt. I just love this shirt. I think the white is a very vibrant white. I love that the stitching is there actually. Weirdly enough, it's like, this is the only brand I've ever worn where I was like, no, I'm glad that it has the little logo there. It's so unobtrusive and so stylistically pleasing to me for whatever reason. I like that it gives the shirt just the tiniest bit of character. And I think that the shirt fits super well. Ah yes, the Gramercy Tech pullover. Okay, so when I was ordering this, I was looking at all the colors and I was like, okay, there's the gray, the black, the blue, which I would have gotten, I think, I think it was sold out. I really like it. And then the chocolate truffle. And I wanted to get the chocolate truffle, but it looks like it's like burgundy or mahogany. Again, you know, I'm not the best with colors, but I asked my family, I was like, is this red? And they were like, yes, that is definitely red. And I didn't quite understand the chocolate truffle, but whatever, I got the gray and I really, or the smoked pearl, and I actually really, really like it. It is a mid-weight pullover. And I know that this is kind of a weird time of year to get a pullover, but as you can see, it is on sale right now for that reason. And it's kind of one of those pieces that is just going to stain your wardrobe really nicely. I'm picturing myself like putting it on, sitting out by the fire, uh, and being able to wash it, which is really, really great. The material is super soft. It feels really nice on you. I love the buttons. I think this is actually a really good gift for your dad or your partner. I actually got this in a medium so that I could give it to Jared, and I think that he's absolutely gonna love it and just wear it all the time. So I'd say the Gramercy Tech Pullover is really great, especially with the final sale price of $103. Mm, we love to see it, for sure. So that is it for our clothes for Roan. Really quickly, I do wanna say that this video is sponsored by Roan, and I will say it is a actually a super unique partnership because I've never had a company that was so hands off about a partnership. You know, I kind of said, what are you looking for out of this partnership? Is there anything specifically that you are trying to promote? And they were like, nope, we just want to see you do a clothing haul and we want you to be totally honest. And I was like, well, you know, when I do these clothing hauls, I do give people my real opinion. Otherwise, they're not going to be helpful to people. And they're like, yeah, that's fine. It's like, that's it. No strings attached. And they're like, yes, that is fine. We are really excited to see what you come up with. And this just goes to show that they are super confident about the quality of their clothing. You know, I didn't love every single piece of this clothing brand, but I actually loved so much of it. And they must have just known and had a lot of faith that I would love it. And that is really refreshing to see from a company that they weren't like, no, you can't say anything bad about us, otherwise we're gonna cut it or whatever, you know? This video is sponsored by Roan, but I will say that I gave you my full, honest feedback here, and I just really like this company. A couple of things so that you have a little bit more background on Roan, and again, this was from my research, not from Roan giving me some talking points, right? But I do think that their size inclusivity is pretty good. They go from a small to a double X. I would love to see that widened in the future because it would be something where like some of our dads, we wouldn't be able to shop for clothes here, right? They also have on their website, Responsible Roan. We are not sustainable, we are responsible. And they have a bunch of different initiatives that are actually really kind of refreshing because they're small, doable initiatives about the way that they package their clothes, their tags, responsible Roan here. Yeah, I mean, the types of materials that they're using. They're not kind of bullshitting us, which I really love. Thank you so much for watching this. Oh, 
spit a little bit. Thank you so much for watching this Roan clothing haul. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave me a comment below letting me know what clothes were your favorite. I hope that this is helpful so you can pick out some clothes for yourself, for your partner, for your dad, and I will see you back next time.